up to Bianca's Tarot. Sorry to drink my water. Um, I'm going to be doing a tarot reading on Lisa from Blackpink. Um, I think that's her name. Hopefully that I'm, I'm remembering the right person. To be honest, I'm not like the biggest K-pop stan or anything like that. I just, um, people request the readings and I do it. And if it feels right, I'll do it. So I did get a yes to read for her. Um, by the way, any of you, if you request some people and I don't read for them, it, I do see the comments. It's just, uh, most of the time, I, I actually do get a no a lot for celebrity readings. Like, um, it just, it doesn't always feel right to read for them on my channel. So that could be why um, you're not seeing those readings up on the channel yet. If it's just not the right time or I'm just not meant to do it in general. So anyway, let's just see how she's doing. Okay. Keeps talking about... She's trying to be patient about a lot of things right now in her life. Um... It feels like she's just planted a seed, not literally, but like something has been planted in her life and she's just kind of waiting on, um, she's trying to wait patiently for something. I don't know exactly what that is, but I do feel like through this experience, she is gaining more wisdom. I feel like she's learning to be a more patient person and just kind of trust in, in, the natural way that timing works. Um, I feel like there's something about a pregnancy for her. Um, Cause I feel like there's just like something growing, but I, I wouldn't be surprised actually if she is pregnant or um, thinking of that. I don't know why I'm getting that, but I do feel like um, if I'm wrong, she is kind of just like kind of, um, she is more, she does like her own company more lately these days. I don't feel like it's like in a lonely way. I feel like she's genuinely kind of um, taking more time to herself. There's possibility of pregnancy here, especially with that theme of growth or something growing. It could be a soul. If, it, if I'm wrong about that, she's just kind of really focused on her own growth as a person and other things that she wants to see kind of grow in her life. Um, I do feel like she is in a peaceful space though it feels like there, there is something about being calm and being patient and being grateful to um it feels like she's kind of learning those things in life um so when we look at the overall energy for her page of cups i, I don't know why i keep picking up a pregnancy for her i hope i'm wrong about that um and th not that i hope i'm wrong i just mean like if she's not if she doesn't want that right now, I hope I'm wrong. If she does want that, then that's beautiful. I am picking up a pregnancy for... She feels pregnant to me. Um, I feel like she's pregnant. I don't know. I could be wrong. Um, it keeps talking about her being isolated. Like I feel like she wants to be alone um, or wants more alone time. I think she gets drained by big crowds and big things like um, by doing big events or big crowds um she gets drained a lot by that she feels more introverted lately than not it keeps talking about it's the same reading it's like the same thing it's it's talking about her being patient for growth or patient like she's being patient and still right now and she's she's what she's like excited for something to grow um Nine of Pentacles. She does feel like stable within herself. Have the moon. I feel like she's hiding something um, personal. Like it feels like she's personally withdrawing herself right now from like, I guess you could say the public, but I guess in general from people, it feels like she really wants her alone time. And I, I don't know why I'm picking up a pregnancy. She feels like she feels with a child to me, the more I, I kind of delve in her energy. Um, I usually don't do a third spread on this, but I have to ask, um, is she like with a child? I keep getting something about children. Um, 
I don't know, you know, I'm not going to jump the gun and say for sure, but um, I think she is pregnant right now or she is going to have a baby very, very soon in her life. Um, it doesn't feel too far away because I have this like little soul coming in intuitively, I feel, but I am, you know, uh, just my spiritual opinion again, these readings, take them with a grain of salt. That's actually why I turned the comments off on these now. I feel like some fans or stands get a little bit too obsessed with these. It's kind of, it makes me uncomfortable. <laughs> so I just turn off the comments. Um, so with that being said, let's move into her love life. Um, what's the energy like with her love life right now? We have the Queen of Pentacles. Um, Three of Swords. This is so weird because I would think there's a person here. I think she's not happy. 100, I mean, let me keep going. Um, I, 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 um, I do feel like she should work on self-love more. Um, oh my God, what is it? This baby coming through a page of cups. This is like this theme of a child here. Wow. Oh my goodness. What's going on? Um yikes i don't think she's in the most I, I don't know i don't think she's happy with that area of her life um i think she struggles with a lot of anxiety um with relationships and there's like a lot of self-love issues i don't know and i think that um she's feeling kind of heartbroken about someone um it feels like there's an energy about like I just want to see why the heartbreak is here. She feels like she was lied to. Um, I don't know if this is recently. Oh, I just asked Seven of Swords, Knight of Wands. For all my tarot readers, you know this is like the biggest F-boy spread ever. I feel like she just dealt with an F-boy or someone in general who just wasn't trustworthy. The person was very emotionally immature and compulsive. She feels absolutely heartbroken um i don't know if she got pregnant by that person or there was something about um children with them i'm not sure what i'm picking up on i do feel that there was something in her love life right now or just that just recently take that took place which was draining so here's the story really she's either with someone and it's just emotionally draining um, the person is cheating on her. Um, they're not faithful there and she's aware of it. I feel like this person is, doesn't treat her great if she's in a relationship. Um, I, but I do feel like with the eight of cups, she's kind of walked away from this or she's leaving a person behind. So basically to top it off, like her love life right now is just in one word draining. It's emotionally draining. Um, and she's, it's affecting her self-esteem and um, I'm so sorry to, to pick that up in my reading. Um, she does not feel that great there. Um, I want to see what this another deck says. And then I'm going to do an oracle spread and then that's it. How is she? Um, actually, I didn't. Did I use my light sears? Let me use my light sears. How does she feel in her love life right like what's her love life like right now is she with someone high priestess why would i keep getting something about pregnancy with her oh no i got this twice so oh, no i feel like kind of i feel so bad for her i feel like she is i think there's a person like that's cheating on her or like there's a lot of drama and it's affecting it's giving her a lot of anxiety i feel like her like it's like, I have the moon again. I got the nine of swords and the moon. This is the second time I'm getting this. And I keep getting queen of pentacles. I feel like she's really just trying to focus on herself. So it's like the same thing. I mean, I'm, I'm kind of like a broken record here. She's feeling anxious, frustrated, and sad. And I think that's really just how she feels towards her love life so again if she's with someone it's miserable and draining if she's single she's just kind of recovering from something that um 
was that took a toll on her spiritually and emotionally. Okay. Um, I'll do it. I don't really even feel like an oracle spread is necessary, but um, I'll do it for the heck of it. How is her love life? fun times i feel like she's single more than not to be honest fair male it feels like there is someone she's heavily thinking about though if this person is of a lighter complexion than a darker complexion lighter friendship she doesn't really feel like she's with someone i think she wants that and she desires that but i feel that she's kind of more um, single. She feels more single to me than, um, like, actually with someone. And God help her with those two spreads if she has actually is still in a, trying to commit to that, because I feel like it's draining the, the hell out of her. Um, so that's with her love life. Again, I'm not feeling... I'll try to do... Let me ask one more card, because I know people really come to these readings for that, but I'm not feeling the best energy with that to tell you the truth her love life right now romantic feelings religious factors um past life relationship i feel like there's someone she has a lot of feelings for where like there's they're spiritually not aligned with her i don't know if they they have the same morals and values of her as her. I feels like they're on different paths spiritually or just in general in life. Like they're misaligned. Um, so yeah. Um, so yeah, I, I kind of just feel bad. I will, let me do one more spread on this actually to ask, will it improve one day for her? Cause I, I actually really kind of feel bad for her. Like it, it, I can feel her emotions. Like I really, I mean, this just sucks what she's feeling right now with that. Let me just ask, will it improve for her one day? There is a better person coming for her. Oh my God, he's so much better. It feels like a guy, um, I don't know what her, you know, what she prefers, but it feels more of like a masculine energy. Way better. I think he struggles with self-love too. Um, he might be kind of, I wouldn't say shy, but he's definitely more on the humble side of things. I think he is more introverted and extroverted like her, or at least lately how she's been. And I do feel that this guy is way, is, he feels a lot older than her and he feels really mature. He feels completely different than whatever negative energy I'm picking up right now. So um, it, Yes, it will improve for her. I actually feel like there's a way better person coming for her. Um, so career, how is she feeling towards her career? Nine, why do I keep getting this card for her? Um, I think she's really worried about stuff with her career. I don't know why. There's something um, she's not happy about with oh my why do I keep picking up this pregnancy story like I'm picking up something about her being pregnant and now it's coming up in the career reading I don't understand this I I don't know I'm gonna go with my gut I feel like there's something about her having children or wanting children or maybe being with a child right now that's affecting career possibly possibly Please don't take that literally. I am not God. It's just my spiritual opinion. But there is some anxiety about career right now. And it could be related to that. Because um, when I asked, I got the Empress and the Five of Pentacles to clarify. Um, mm, you know... It's one of those things where she has some serious decisions to make right now with career. And she has to choose what she really, really wants out of life. And I think that's really difficult for her right now. I feel like the Three of Cups can represent the Black Pink Band. And what I'm feeling, like how she feels towards the band, you know, it's like... She really loves those girls. Like, there's genuinely a, a love. But 
I don't feel like she wants to do this like forever. I, I, I do feel that she she really loves the girls. But when I first ask about her, her energy is the Four of Cups. So I feel that... Um, I think she's changing her mind about a lot of things with her career right now. And it's kind of putting a lot of stress on her. And it's causing her to overthink because it's like heart over her mind. What does she really want out of life? I do feel like she kind of wants to live a more normal life. She kind of feels like um, Prince Harry to me. Like, I'm not saying she wants to escape the band. Like, it, it, the band isn't necessarily toxic, but she feels... She kind of feels like she um, wants just a different life, in a sense, like, for herself. Um, I'll just double check. How does she feel again towards career? Give me two cards. King of Pentacles. Three of Swords. It's uh, it's literally what I... It's like she's torn. Eight of Wands. I think there's just something that she feels is missing that she feels... But I don't know. It feels it's not that she hates her job though. I she enjoys she enjoys it for the most part, but I feel that she kind of feels like things are lacking a little bit in her life and I feel like she kind of is starting to change her mind about what she wants in her career, you know? It's it's like that. I want to use one of these cards. I never usually use the oracle cards for these spreads. I just want to see something. How is she feeling towards career? emotional withdrawal yeah she's um changing her mind i will say about a lot of things um i think she's changing her mind so how does she feel towards her friendships ten of wands seven of pentacles six of pentacles i do feel like she's really close to an earth sign or fire sign it feels like that person's really caring she, there's a like a caring energy from this person um it feels like she's really close to some female friend in her life um i don't think she has a lot of friends right now or people she calls a friend i think there's only really one person standing out she feels kind of like a lack of support and she doesn't even really trust many people to consider a friend it feels like there's only really one person and she's kind of more focused on her career anyway but um the moon, ten of wands, she's kind of like, I don't feel like she feels like she has a bunch of friends in her life or pe like to really, cons I mean, my definition of a friend is someone you can really count on and stuff like that. So it feels like there's only one person she feels is worthy of that title right now. I don't think she's like, um, again, she, I, I'm not sure if she's an introverted person in general, but at this moment in her life, she's not like um, that social or like that concerned about like friendships and stuff like that. Um, how does she feel towards her family? Two of Cups. Um, she's actually really happy. Um, she's she feels really. Um, I'm getting a positive feeling. Um, I also feel like she's been um, venting to them about the things on her mind lately, like how she's feeling kind of undecided about things. I get a lot of support there. I like that. That's kind of the best spread of the whole reading, to be honest. So I'm happy about that. She feels like supported. How does she feel towards her family? Three of Wands, Page of Cups. I mean, I'm getting great energy. Ten of Swords, Four of Swords. So Four of Wands. I feel like she has been venting to them about some things that, um, she's been feeling stuck on or upset about i don't know why i keep picking up this pregnancy thing but um i do feel like she's been venting to them about some personal things maybe not all of them but there's at least someone in the family she's been she's been having a, um, a good type of relationship with so let's go into the near future with her energy and then i'll close out the reading but what does the near future look like for her Lisa partnerships and alliances there will be great support um I'm feeling like there is something positive with a group obviously she's in a band so I, that could be that but I also feel like there's like a 
to, like there's a I just feel like an overwhelming amount of support in her life so there will be like great partnerships and alliances and people she can um I don't know I just hear I'm feeling it's just about support suffering and silence yeah I feel that um her she just kind of should work on she overthinks like a shit ton I think she should work on that because I do feel like the suffering and silence to me, like although there's support, I feel like she just holds so much in and I would recommend, like I don't know, I just feel like that's not healthy. So I feel that that's still going to be kind of an issue for her in the future. Um, yeah, I, I think people will i see someone i see some sort of support but i also feel like she's gonna resist that or still kind of keep too many things in you know um heartache and loss yeah um a celebrated motion i also feel like oh there's a lot of travel for her obviously since she's a celebrity and she travels um she could be moving though i feel like in the next maybe max eight years i do feel like there's a shift in she's going to be living in a very she's going to be living in a different country um i'm hearing eight with that so there's something with that um i think that it's going to be good for her but i am a little concerned about her just kind of like her emotional like just her emotions i guess in the near future is going to be a bit of a challenge for her so in the near future how is it looking like for her two of cups um she is gonna have some support i don't know if it's romantic or friends or whatever the hell but she's gonna be supported um she will be m considering moving away yeah um oh wow there's a lot of support i also feel like her love life will improve tremendously she will have a soulmate or whatever twin flame however you want to define that she will have love and support in some form in her life which um or she will have finally feel that um and i say finally because i don't feel right now she's um in terms of uh, in general feeling that supported um i do think she's gonna make a decision to to take the i don't know why i'm hearing the hard way to take the hard way i don't know why i'm hearing that um yeah i don't know why i'm hearing that but i feel like she's gonna take a different path um especially with her location i also see her moving away with someone i have this guy here seven of pentacles page of wands i think she will have a child as well within the next i don't know i feel like she she's gonna be a mother um and then a couple of years if she's not already i have two that keeps popping up for her so two could be important or something in two months two years is going to be important maybe the month of february i don't know um but in the near future it looks a lot better for her i feel like she should be her heart should remain open because i do feel like there's good things coming in and um i one the beautiful thing i like about tarot is like it shows the ups and downs of life right like she can like you just saw in the reading, you know, I didn't get the best love rating, but I am picking up good things in the future. You know, you never know. Life has um, some bad surprises, but also has some really, really good surprises. And as I'm saying that Wheel of Fortune is at the base, <laughs> things will things will turn around for her um, for the better, I'm feeling. Um, and yeah, I do. Um, this was a this was a fun reading. Um, I hope the fans like it. Thank you so much for watching. If you'd like to book a personal reading with me, you can through my website. And I'll see you guys soon. Bye.